Hi everyone, thanks so much for coming back, joining me for my December daily. So, today is Wednesday. <laughs> I'm laughing because about an hour ago I was convinced it was Friday. Absolutely convinced. So every Friday, Mandy and I take it in turns to post a welcome new members post in our Facebook group. And I was so convinced that it was Friday, I put the post up didn't think anything of it and it was only until I was reminding myself that tomorrow is Saturday and so therefore I need to put up the Saturday post which is like um you know share products share shops social links that type of post we do that every Saturday as well again taking it in turns I was writing it down on my to-do list to say right must remember to do that tomorrow when I saw hmm it's not Friday today it's not a Saturday tomorrow it's Wednesday <laughs> So that is me, that is day one of not having a schedule, a working schedule. And I've already completely messed up what day it is. I was thinking all day it was Friday and it's not. So that was my day, how was yours? <laughs> oh, it, you know, it is funny. I'm such an empty, but it is really, really very, very funny. Um, I think part of the reason why I was confused is because I was filming this morning and I don't normally film on a Wednesday. Um, normally I film on a Friday, so that's probably why, but I was filming something very exciting. I, as you know from yesterday's video, I was filming the, the leg warmers, <laughs> the, uh, the, the file folder covers and the journal covers using the leg warmers, which was an interesting experiment, shall we just say? Um, I, I will show you how they, how they look. Um, I haven't sewn them yet. I was going to do that this afternoon because by the time I'd finished all four of them uh, this morning, it was lunchtime. So I paused for lunch and then I thought, oh, I don't really want to come and sit at my sewing machine. I just don't fancy it this afternoon. So I'm not going to do it. <laughs> um, but they are ready to go. They are ready for sewing. So would you like to take a peek? I'll hold them up. I won't flip the camera around because it's only just to, to briefly show you. Okay, so this is the one of the grey file folders. You can see this bit at the top, I will need to cover that after I've done the sewing um, because obviously you can see that from the front, but this is how this one is looking. It has a leg warmer on it, which is a plus, and it feels really nice and cosy. Um, it's got the closure in, just some, some ribbon in the middle, um, and then of course it's just waiting for the wreath, which is this one. And I finished these yesterday, so I've got a bow and a pink charm. And I think that looks quite nice. I don't know, like I'm not 100% settled on it. I think I like it, but it's one of those things where I just want to have a think about it and decide, you know, is that definitely the thing that I want? Um, so we'll just see, but that is, you know, currently the plan. It feels really nice with the, the leg warmers. So that's the grey one. This is the black one, which still has pins in it. Now this one was the first one that I did, and you'll see these videos in the new year, but this is just, you know, um, if you're gonna hang out with me, you might as well get some sneak peeks and behind the scenes info, mightn't you? <laughs> um, so yeah, this was the first one I did using the black leg warmers, and I've got the lace around because uh, my original plan was I just wanted to cut the leg warmers and not have them fold over because they were quite uh, thick, you know, they're thick and woolly. And I was worried that they would um, like be too bulky in the middle if I was to fold them over like you would a fabric journal. So this one, I decided to do it with the lace instead. And I, I really like how it looks. It's got, um, can you see all these little like snowflakes? So as I say, I've not sewn them. It's just, they're pinned on, but you know, um, that's the, that, that side and it goes all the way round. And it's given it quite a nice, almost like a frame. So I did decide not to use the wreath on this one because of how this looks. It looks like a lacy woolly jumper. Um, and so instead I'm gonna go with something more simple in the middle, like um, uh, maybe a picture or probably just a book plate because I just really like how, how that all looks. So yeah, it was a bit of an experiment this morning, but I'm happy with them. So that's the file folders. And then I, <clears throat> decided that I wanted to do some um, journal covers with the other leg warmers. Um, so I did. <laughs> Here's the black one. This is using a bubble mailer, so it's nice and 
here. I love that sound. It's all nice and squidgy and soft and cosy, which is what I wanted for them. And again, not stitched, but I've got the my favourite gold upholstery fabric on the inside. So um, I'll stitch around and then I don't know what these covers will have on them. Um, I haven't got as far as that yet. I just wanted to get um, the leg warmers on to make sure that the idea works, um, which it does. But you'll see from the video when you come to watch it that I wouldn't recommend going out and buying leg warmers. But am I glad that I was able to use them from my stash and give them a new purpose considering I wasn't using them? Yes, of course I am. But I wouldn't, I wouldn't recommend using them for a journal cover, really. It's worked out so far, <laughs> fingers crossed. Um, but I wouldn't go out of my way to do it. I was just using them, basically. And wait for it because I'm really proud of this one. Again, same sort of thing, another grey one. But this one, I wanted another bubble mailer, but I only had one in my stash. So this one is made from two chocolate box liners. You know the um, the like plasticky, I don't know, plastic like squidgy things that sit on top of the tray of chocolates? Yeah, two of those is what made this one. So again, it's got the, hopefully you can hear that and you're not just looking at me thinking, what is she doing? It's got the nice crunchy feel to it and the soft, soft feel, squidgy feel to it. But it was using two of those. So again, it's on the video, uh, coming in the new year. Just going to turn my heater off. Um, and I was really proud. So yeah, that's, um, you know, if you haven't got any bubble mailers, but you have chocolate box liners, because, you know, <laughs> maybe you do, then, um, uh, you know, stay tuned for the video, because um, I'll show you how I made a lovely, a lovely cover. And they feel so nice. So I'm glad that I gave it a go, even if it was a bit, Oh God, has you know how is this going to go? Kind of thing. Um, but it did, it did seem to work out, so I was pleased about that. Um, so those are now sitting proudly by my sewing machine, waiting to be sewn around. Um, and then essentially that will be that video, you know, finished, and that will be part one of the actually making the file folders and making the journals. So it's very exciting, isn't it? So I hope you like how they're coming along so far. As I say, very behind the scenes because I've not sewn them yet. But um, yeah, I've given it a go. <laughs> and um, hopefully the video makes sense. I haven't watched it back yet, so um, we'll have to see about that. But I gave it a go, so that's the main thing. And that's pretty much me. That is what I was doing the bulk of this morning. And then this afternoon, I was just really catching up on watching people's YouTube videos. Um, I had a lot from the calendar event that I needed to catch up on been meaning to all week so I thought best of it now and um, yeah some some fab makes and some wonderful ladies so I'm glad to be able to you know have that time to finally catch up a bit um and that's pretty much it um I don't really have strict plans this afternoon um I might just go and watch some more YouTube to be honest I kind of just feel like having um a lazy afternoon because I did do four covers this morning, you know, that was quite a lot of gluing and thinking. So yeah, I might just have a chill afternoon and evening, um, just watching a bit of YouTube, I think. I think that's what I fancy, so I might do that. Um, so yeah, that's, that's pretty much me for today. Um, so yeah, what are you up to? Do you know it's Wednesday today? <laughs> I can't believe I did that. I just, yeah, absolute numpty, but you know, did make me laugh thinking, what? <laughs> like, what? Oh, goodness me. So yeah, that's me without a schedule. So, you know, who knows what tomorrow's video will bring? We'll have to see. Um, but, uh, but yeah, that's, 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 that's essentially me. Um, so yeah, I don't know when I'll get around to stitching these sometime this week. Um, but you know, they're all ready and they're all nice and neat. Like, I've been quite neat with the leg warmers I think and um, because I was trying to be ever so neat about it because I don't want to use book corners especially not on the altered file folders and to be honest I've kind of gone off of book corners I don't think I want to use book corners anymore <laughs> um yeah it's I don't know it's something that 
I've just come to not like them. I like the look of them, I just don't like using them. They're a bit of a pain to get on and I just think, well, what's wrong with it looking a little bit scrappy and all the rest of it? Like, you know, um, that's why we love these types of journals, isn't it? So I've kind of gone off the idea of using book corners. So I might never use a book corner ever again. <laughs> we'll have to see. But um, but yeah, that's kind of like my love-hate relationship with them at the moment. Um, anyway, I'd best go because I'm going to start doing that thing where I just start talking about absolutely nothing. And um, we don't want that, do we? <laughs> Alright then, well thank you ever so much for joining me again, I really appreciate you watching these videos, it's been you know, re a real joy to be able to just share these little silly things with you and you know, joyous things with you really, um, and yeah, I'll catch you tomorrow I guess, um, have a lovely evening, rest of day, morning if you're in Australia I think, um, and yeah, let me know what you're up to and whether you know that it is Wednesday today, I'd love to know, <laughs> or is that complete news to you as well? Um, so yeah, let me know and uh, we'll speak soon. Bye for now.